know this game is dead as shit, my nigga. But if y'all niggas still play this game, y'all niggas want to make new builds, but you ain't, you're not trying to grind badges because my career is boring as shit. You know, if, if y'all just want to buy accounts and be on different accounts like that, y'all niggas swan. You feel me? Um, Hit up Sports. His link will be in the description. You know, he sells accounts. He grinds badges. And he also sells Fortnite accounts. So I know all you geek-ass niggas that want all these little OG skins and all, all, all that shit, nigga. You know, it's just something you'd be interested in. If you are interested in that, his link will be in the description. And tell him that nigga Young Swan sent you. So yeah, man, not, not only does he upgrade your player, do all the bad shit, all, all that other shit, if you want to sell your account to him and um, get a profit from it, or you want to sell your Fortnite account to him, you can do that also. His link is in the, in the description, my guy. And yeah, man, I appreciate you so much. And I'm out this bitch, nigga. It's supposed to be a moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? One man, one show! One I'm army, nigga! <laughs> I'm a go! God, nigga! What? Really, nigga? Say, man, so... We got some more news, my nigga. And it's not looking good. Basically, everything that we've seen or got information from, rumors or whatever, it it hasn't been information niggas want. You feel me? So it's kind of sad, my nigga. Hey, for all the sensitive, lame-ass fucking virgins that are about to comment in my comment section, hey, you a lame square nigga, bro. This is just a video expressing my thoughts. Get off my dick. Stop writing paragraphs in my comment section. Nobody cares, you little lame dweeb geek. Okay? I'm just letting you know, my nigga. Like, shut your stupid ass up, my guy. Do something more productive in your life, you lame nigga. Oh, you're talking like this. Oh, my God. Hey, my channel not for the sensitive fuck, nigga. Keep it stepping, man. But as I was saying, man, so look. This ain't looking good, bro. You feel me? You know, I want this game to be really good and amazing. But I'm about to give y'all my thoughts about this. It's very toxic shit, man. So look. This nigga Colby hates 2K. <laughs> that is his name. <laughs> Baluba. Can you make a poll about if... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. First, I'm gonna need y'all to all like the video and subscribe if you're new. Support a real nigga. Uh, I love you so much. But as I was saying, Baluba, can you make a poll about if we want walking size ups in 2K19? By the way, nobody wants them. Now, this is a fact, okay? Even, even like, there's literally, there can only be like 10% of people who want walking size ups. And that's like really bad people. Like, like niggas that suck at the game, they'd be like, oh, I don't want that dribble spammer. Huh, huh. But look what's happening. <laughs> niggas is still s spamming dribbles, nigga. Like, there's no stop to it. What you're doing is just making the gameplay more sluggish and boring and decreasing the skill gap. By making niggas wait unintentionally, you're look, th this is why I say 2K18 is the most unrealistic 2K ever. And niggas can't grasp this. I, I don't know why I think alone in this in this subject, bro. I guess I'm just better than every I, I don't I don't fucking know, bro. But look, never in any video game or 2K have when you moved. You, you automatically, you take one step in 2K, nigga, you automatically activate the walking size up. You understand that? You're battling the walking size up more than you're battling your defender. That's not real. When you dribble in real life and shit, you're not battling a walking size up, nigga. It is literally built into you. 
There's no way to turn it off. It is the most toxic, cancerous, game-ruining feature of all fucking time. Most unrealistic bullshit in the fucking universe. This nigga really thought, this nigga Mike Wayne really thought that implementing this was a game changer. <laughs> I'm not going to go look for the tweets back then. He was like, man, if you really want to be a head and step of the game, you learn to master your walking. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Learn to master your walking size. Up. <laughs> no. What? What the fuck, my nigga? That shit is ass. Okay. It was put there to try and, you know, stop eyesores, dribblers, and, and, and all of that shit. And it doesn't work. It just ruins all of gameplay. Okay? And nobody wants that shit, bro. I, I, would, bro, I, I made so many videos about that. But let's get into what Mike Wang says, bro. Walking size-ups are implemented differently for 2K19. You won't accidentally get them anymore. So, <sighs> this is sad, my nigga. So, look, bro. Oh, my God. Look, man. So, hold on, man. I'm going to talk about the size up shit later on, but I want to talk about something else real quick. Okay, so when it comes to dribbling, and, and all that other type of shit. I prefer 16 for dribbling. You know, I thought it was the most real cool, you know, like, you know, you know, created a skill gap, you know, spammers, they couldn't fuck with you, okay? They could not, anyone, like, like I used to play versus I Run You, A Mark, all them niggas before they were known. And I used to drop these niggas the fuck off, bro. Like, bad. And, I mean, it was... A, but I never played him at 17. But it was like, that shit didn't matter if you were actually good, you know? In 17, it was the same thing. But the thing was, the shit was so fancy that the whole community just blew up. You know? There was certain shit I didn't like about 17 dribbling. There was a lot of shit I didn't like about it. But when you really think about it, like, if you were actually good, like, I've never been dropped off by a dribble guy, ever, okay? Anytime you've ever seen a comp player that's, like, in the stage and shit play against a dribble guy, he would beat him, you know? So it was, it was, so it was cool, you know? Because it's just for show. And the community blew up. We had fucking Hank blew up, okay? Y'all might look at him different, but Hank. I run you, A Mark, fucking um, cheese, um, just so many people just based off of fucking dribbling, not not being creative content or being the first at some, just dribbling, and that that's kind of like Fortnite. When you see really good people, you know they blow up. That's how gaming should be. Th that was like one of the first years where. Like, when people saw some shit, you know, even though it's not, like, a skill thing, it's more of just, like, oh, if you dribble, you dribble. I guess it's skillful dribbling. I don't, I don't fucking know, nigga. But that's how the game should be for the sake of the community. I know a lot of y'all, like, a lot of you, just a lot of people in general, they don't like that dribbling shit. But, I mean, for, for the sake of the game, to get these little kids into it all year, bro. That shit gotta go crazy in 19, bro. For the sake of the game. Like, like, if they had like something similar to 17, but like you you can't double momentum spam. I don't know if y'all remember that shit, but that shit shouldn't have been in the game, nigga. <laughs> Niggas would come down the car. <laughs> this is oh, spamming momentum. That shit had to go, nigga. That that was too much. But all that other shit, that shit was cool, my nigga. Yo, y'all niggas just don't know how to guard it, bro. Y'all niggas not smart, my nigga. Like, all you have to do is back the fuck up and keep fucking with your distance or reach. It's so easy. It's so easy, bro. It's so easy, my nigga. 
But but for the sake of 2K, my nigga, the dribbling gotta go crazy. This year, it wasn't it wasn't like that, my nigga. Very dull and plain, and everybody could do what everyone else could do before Steezo came along. You feel me? And that that's why this game wasn't viewed like that, man. You you gotta have some type of some type of flashy feature to where not everyone can do what everyone else can do and then you'll have a somewhat pop in 2k my nigga we, we have to hold the l man you know like us people who don't like all that dribbling shit if we want this game to last you know you know we gotta accept that shit my nigga and just you know that that's how it gotta be you feel me niggas niggas don't want to see that <laughs> Oh, oh, three, three, like that, that shit not gonna keep the game alive, my nigga, I promise you, Any, anyone can, you know, but, but, but for instance, like, look, I'm gonna break down what this nigga say, right, so, even with all the backlash that we gave this nigga about walking size ups, he still puts it in the game, he never patched it once, he left it in the game all year, so my faith that we won't accidentally trigger it for 2K19 is minimal. Because why wouldn't you implement that in 18? You know? Why make us suffer something no one no one wants in the game? You know? What the fuck? <laughs> As I was saying, why make us suffer something that you you had the ability to to really switch my guy and to be honest my nigga a lot of people said 2k18 was a beta they might be right bro everything we've complained about and say we didn't want from all the leaks and shit we're hearing it's still here bro you know it's kind of sad my nigga Hey, I ain't trying to down the game, you know, kill it. I, I, I don't give a fuck, bitch. Giving my opinion, suck a dick. I ain't trying to brainwash nobody. I'm, I'm just talking, nigga. Okay? But this nigga crazy, bro. I don't. <laughs> y'all let me know how y'all feel about all this shit, bro. Y'all let me know if y'all think dribbling's gonna be lit. Let me know if you think dribbling's gonna take skill. Let a nigga know what your favorite 2K was to dribble in. And let me know if you like walking size ups, nigga. You feel me? Uh, <laughs> a sad day, man. I'm out this bitch. I hope you niggas enjoy it. Subscribe if you know. Bye.